Welcome back to Kelly Tech. As of lately, I've been trying to set up my game room. And to do so, I've been working on a lot of devices and doing a lot of soldering. So, I decided to get a new soldering gun. So, let's hope, or iron, excuse me. Let's hope that this is a good one. So, is it Mercier? Yeah, we're going to go with Marseille. Yeah, I butcher everything, but I try. I give me credit. And here we go. Got a bag full of stuff. Let's see, VIP card. Some little card to maybe win a prize type situation. Comes some solder. Lead free solder. Huh. I don't know if you can see that. tips <laughs> get this box out of the way Put the sucker together. <laughs> Even though I have no clue how to. <laughs> uh. mm. And it should just pop on here. Seems like a little further. There we go. Oh, she's in there. This is actually pretty high quality. I wasn't uh, expecting it to be this nice, actually. This is pretty nice. I um, was not expecting this high quality. And I love the bit set. Perfect. Really nice. That's what that brain is for. So, we got our cable here. Oops. Looks like you might even be able to put a couple different kinds on there. <laughs> Nice. And you can take out your tips, put them in their holder. Oh, yeah. This is turning out to be a sleek little unit. So, so far we got a nice machine. Alright guys, here she is all put together. Hmm. 
something nice. Looks like a nice piece of machinery. So, hopefully I can get this off without having too much trouble. So, now we need to plug her in. <sighs> I say we put it at about maybe 5.50 maybe. 16. It's touching. <laughs> wow. It really gets up there that fast. That is insane. And that's Fahrenheit. Alright, so now we need something to fix. Alright. I think I have our donor. Yeah, that's the easy way. He always makes it easy. I guess that's the whole point of the video. We got a soldering iron. <laughs> Pretty hot. All right. Let's pull out the heavy equipment here. That's right. I used a cheater. Whatever. <laughs> Okay, so let's try to put these back together. Let's see. Come on. Just a nice little touch at the end. Oh yeah. What do you think? You think she can handle it? Oh, I'd have to turn it on first, though. <laughs> so I'm going to set it for... I'm going to start off at 650. Just do a quick little... Quick little... Soldering of a joint here. Yeah, I really like this little station. There's a lot of really good things about it. You got your cleaning section over here. I love the digital readout. That's really nice. Uh, hopefully you can see that from up there. Uh, I love the dedicated power on and off switch too. That's that's a nice that's a nice feature. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of a lot of pros to this one, especially for the price. So it hasn't been sitting long. It says six forty nine, but I don't know if that's just what it's set for, or if it's actually at the tip six forty nine. I'm left handed, so this is gonna be kind of weird. See it's already. It's yeah. nice. It's easy to be precise with it. Not bad. Hmm. Like if 
if you want to. Yeah. Well, that's nice. Worked over real nice. Huh. Got a stray here. Wow. I'm actually pretty impressed with that. Pretty cool. Seems to have done the job very well. Of course, I was a little sloppy. Okay, yeah, that's a very good joint. It's just, wow. And that was just on the quick. Not even practicing with the temperatures or anything. So, nice. Very nice. <laughs> All right, so I would definitely recommend this. I mean, unless you're completely spoiled rotten, this thing is amazing. And I'd really recommend to get one of these too. They're super cheap and you can get them everywhere. But, well, I guess that's that, guys. My opinion, I like it. If you have a different opinion, leave it down in the comments. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, like and subscribe. And as always, have a tech day.